Hello. And just tell me a little bit about the girls, their right. names, and why you decided to send them to training, what their biggest struggles are, and what you hope to get out of this. So this is Liberty right here. She was my baby. She was uh, my COVID dog. And uh, we obviously grew attached. We spent every waking moment together. And then when the world resumed, <laughs> then she had a lot of anxiety and she was just like getting nervous. And then when um, my full-time job and my uh, you know small business started taking off, I had others watching her and she just developed like some nervous habits, like uh, getting a little anxious or, you know, like being a little spiteful and like having accidents, waiting for me. Yeah. But um, she's the most lovable, most, you know, sweet, sweet dog anyone's ever met. And then I got her a friend or her So they're not pet. related. So not related. Okay. Same same uh, type of dog, both okay. Tomskis, but not related by blood. And uh, got her a friend and this is Justice. Justice is smart. She is pretty easy to train, but she has a personality. <laughs> so she likes to jump and paw, like to get food. Um, she likes to like do her little like yaps in the crate to say like I want out or like you know take me outside or whatever so um i love that she communicates but not <laughs> at seven in the morning yeah not at two in the morning yeah so um for her you know a lot of it's just a uh, temperament in the crate as well as you know what not to do like not to jump or to like play as if she's a tough dog yeah you know she's only gonna walk up to you and lick her and for liberty it's to be you know more obedient but uh less spiteful and um by training them you know, it'll be better quality of life for the three of yeah. us. 